Hello doll lovers, it's Ruby Red's World of Dolls and welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope that all is well, fantastic and fabulous your way. I am here with the Barbie Extra and I am so excited. You Barbie fans out there, Barbie collectors, doll collectors, you've seen the hype, you've heard the hype, you've seen the pics, you know about these dolls. You will have to be living up under a rock for the last year to not have heard about the new Barbie Extra dolls. I am so excited to have these two dolls. They were delivered yesterday and um, I didn't have time to unbox them. So here I am today ready to unbox them and check them out, pose and photograph these dolls. Now there is five dolls in this series and I these two are my favorite. I have number four and number five. And I just love these girls. And again, these two were my favorite of the five. But I am going to get all five of the girls. Now, number four, I had to get her. She's a curvy girl. I'm a curvy girl. I My heart, my heart is always in um, favor of the curvy girl. I love her hair. I love that face mold. It's one of my favorites. I mean, her skin tone. She has freckles. I think she has hazel eyes. And I'm loving how they styled her. Everything about her is fabulous. I'm loving the packaging, the artwork. Everything on these dolls are awesome. A lot of time and effort and thought went into these dolls. And I'm very pleased about that. Here is the back of her box. You've got another great picture of the artwork you got a picture of all the accessories that she comes with she comes with 15 styling pieces and here is a shot of all of the girls that you can get in this series of dolls these dolls are $24.88 each on Amazon um, on walmart.com they weren't available for immediate ship on Amazon right now from my end the only place I've been able to find them were Walmart and then there are one I think that's kind of one or two of them that um, are out of stock but I'm sure they'll be back here is number five check out the packaging love it love it love it again loving that artwork it's just awesome loving her face mo as well she's another diva that I love I'm loving her style I'm just loving it loving it loving it loving it here is the back of her packaging and again you get a shot of all the things that she comes with 15 styling pieces this is the diva that everybody ran for the one that has to shine bright glasses I love her. I love them all. But she was not my favorite of the five. She was just not. But she is sold out on Walmart.com. Sure, she'll be back in stock. And then I'll be definitely ready to get her. I'm loving the Barbie in this series. You know, we usually get burned out with Barbie. But they have outdone themselves with styling her in this Barbie Extra line. And she is definitely a must have for my collection. I'm really, really excited about these dolls. I mean, they're so awesome. You almost hate to take them out of the box, but I got to unbox them. And again, I got them from Walmart.com for $24.88 each. So if you're interested, run to Walmart and check it out and see what they, um, see if they've got them in stock and what's coming available. So you know go for that but um sorry guys i had a, got a text message and i was reading the text message but i'm going to unbox them and look at them and review them with you guys i can already tell you they look like they're in there real good and i don't want to you know i want to enjoy unboxing them that's part of getting a new doll is unboxing them and enjoying um and enjoying that part as well so you know I don't want to be under the stress of rushing trying to take them out so I'm going to unbox them and we're going to be back and we're going to check out these divas and look at them up close and in detail BAM Barbie extra in the house guys I am loving these dolls I am just so excited about these Barbie extra dolls so 
unboxing was a little difficult um glad i wasn't trying to save the packaging so i'll just make you aware of that the packaging is a really really tough so let's start with girl number four and show you what she comes with she comes with this awesome skateboard i am loving this skateboard and it has the it's like a graffiti and it says a malibu on there and i love it i love the skateboard i think the skateboard is a awesome accessory these are the colors of the wheels this is how it looks on the bottom loving the skateboard accessory and then she also comes with these neon color like neon green yellow i guess a neon yellowish green color um set of headphones again i love those really really nice then she also comes with these really cool um mirror silver um uh, sunglasses Again, I am very pleased with this accessory. Love it. And then she's got this um, cute little clear um, handbag with a big um, diamond um, closure, open closure there on the front, but you do not open the bag. The bag is not for opening and closing. It has a pink a cell phone there on the front cover. And I mean, another cute a little accessory. And then she has these two little cats with crayons, and um, they're cute as well. Useless to me, but cute as well. Um, they don't have any um, articulation, any movement. You know, they're just two little kitties. So she comes with those. I could have done without the kitties, but you know, we have them. You know, so it comes with part. It comes with the doll. Then I also was able able to savage. Um, her little crayon from off of the packaging, you know, it just pops out real easy So if you decide you want to save that you can save that it has the star Star glitters in there, you know, it's a cute little thing that you can use for decorating or something really like it really cute I was able to savage that all right. So now let's take a look at the doll. She is a fabulous I am loving this doll. I am loving her face sculpt this again is one of my favorites i love her hair i love the style of it it's really soft um good i i'm i'm pleased with it i love again the curls i love the color it's two different colors of blue here turquoise blue whatever blue you want to call it but there's a lighter color and then there's a darker color this is the darker blue here then you got the lighter blue right there and then the top part, her bun, bun is also a dark, dark blue. And she's just gorgeous. And look at that face. And she does have the freckles. I love it. When I saw her close up on her promo pics, I knew that she was going to be my favorite. I love her. And she does have the hazel, hazel looking, um, hazel green, brownish eyes. They are beautiful love her lip color as well i love everything about her face and her hair and then she's wearing these um big big earrings that say this one says this one says girl and that one says power so that's girl power you go girl the earrings are not removable meaning you can cut them or clip them i usually clip the earrings when I get a pair of earrings on a doll or a fashionista that I really want to use or change the doll's look. So you can clip them. I won't because these dolls are going to go on display. Um, I'm not going to be, you know, playing with them. I'm going to photograph them a little bit, but I'm collecting them. So they're going to be on display. So that's her face. Now take a look at the outfit that she wears. Ooh, I love her outfit. I love this jacket. This jacket is awesome. So let me tell you a little something about the jacket. Now, I've already removed the tape, but they had double-sided tape on each cuff of her jacket. And I, I'm assuming they did that because they had the jacket pushed up on her arm and they wanted it to stay in position. Be careful when you try to remove it because you can tear um, or rip some of your um, cuff here on your jacket. So that's just a little bit of advice there for you. So it can be taken off without ruining the jacket, but just be aware that it will have that. So I'm going to go ahead and remove her jacket real quick. 
so that you guys, so we can get a good look at her jacket and her accessories. Let me put her back on the stand. All right, so here is the jacket. The jacket is really nice. Um, it's like that satiny um, feel. And yes, it has a zipper, a functioning zipper. Um, let me show you the inside before I zip it. So this is how it looks on the inside. It's also lined with that orange um, satiny material. And it has a functioning zipper. Let's see how hard it is to zip. And see, for me, with my hands, it might not be the jacket. It probably is me. All right, so let me see if I can get it. I don't want to break my new jacket. Okay, trying to get the zipper lined up. And again, my hands have been giving me trouble. All right, so there we go. So it wasn't the jacket. It was my hand. So the zipper is a functioning zipper. And this is how it looks zipped up. I love the collar of it. You got the same ribbing um, material around the neck of the jacket that you have on the cuff and around the waist of the jacket. Then you have this design here of um, printed on um, shoelaces there going down the side of both sleeves. Really nice piece. I love her jacket. The accessories on this doll is outstanding. All right, so then here is her top, and I'm loving it. I'm just loving her top. All right, so her top does Velcro here in the back. It Velcros here to the waist. I love the colors in this top, this tie-dye. And then it has like a glittery um, shimmer to it. And, I mean, it's just gorgeous. I love all the colors. And then the thing now must be these little um, waist bags, um fanny packs, whatever you want to call them. I'm going to remove hers so I can show you guys what it looks like. Give you guys a detailed review. Alright, so here's her little fanny pack. And this is how it looks. It has the look of a zipper. Real nice look of a zipper. But you know it's not a functioning zipper. But details, details, details. I really like that. Again, love it. And again, I love her outfit. It was one of my favorites. Okay, so her shorts have pockets and I tell you it looks like these are functioning pockets because the looks like I can see the actual pocket inside there so let's see if we can put her hand in. so yes this is a functioning pocket it is definitely that I love the details here on the front you've got the button there in the front there that's a real little um rhinestone or whatever you want to call it to look like a button you have the stitching there to appear to have a zipper it has velcro open closure in the back love the ridges of the shorts i love it love it love it love the waist and design i love this top i love it and she had i think i have lost one of her um arm pieces think she had she did she had on a watch guys and I don't know what happened to her watch I don't know if I lost it when I took her jacket off but she does come with a pink wa a watch I don't remember what color it was but it's around here somewhere so she did have a watch here on this arm and um it's somewhere I've got to find it and then let's check out those cool color um, neon greenish yellow shoes. I love the style. They're like the um, Nike Air Max style shoes. I like them a lot. I love them. And then she has these two bracelets here on her arm that are removable. You've got this one and then you've got the shinier one and then you've got the duller like color I say. And let's talk about the articulation. As you can see, she has a lot of movement in her head. You know, a lot of turns and sides for great poses and photos. The shoulder, arm goes forward and back. It goes out. That's as far as mines go out. They don't go straight out, but that's they go up and they go out like that. And then she has articulation at the elbow the wrists and of course the hip 
and the knee joint. And her joints are a little stiff. I prefer them to be stiff than to be loose. I do. Everybody has their own preference. But this is a diva, and I'm telling you, I am loving this diva. I have got to find her watch. All right, so let's put her sunglasses on so you guys can see how she looks with her sunglasses. <laughs> All right, so there she is with those sunglasses. I love her. She's beautiful. She is a beautiful doll. And I have got to find her watch. I don't know where that watch is. All right, I decided to put them on saddle stands because they have on so much. And sometimes the stands with the waist are kind of hard to get on these dolls. All right, so she was on there perfectly. All right, so that's doll number four. And no, they don't come with doll stands. I was a little disappointed, but I guess these are considered Playline dolls and not collectibles like the BMR 1959 line. I think a lot of people were disappointed that we didn't get the made to move bodies. You know, I prefer made to move bodies, but I'll take an articulated body like this over the five basic five points of articulation any day all right so doll number five i also was able to savage her little um rainbow um image there on her packaging it's just a little cute um piece that you can use to decorate or something later her accessory her little pet is this little doggy here again no articulation he's really cute but you know i could do without the pets and then she's got this pink little Barbie Jeep with real functioning wheels. So, you know, they did give him wheels where he can roll around. You got the Barbie logo on the back there. And this is the side. This is how it looks on the inside. Really detailed. And this is the bottom. You got the Barbie logo printed under there. It's a really cute little accessory to use for something else. But I think I would have rather had a doll stand rather than these. But I'm speaking from the adult collector point, not the child point. Because these, again, are considered Playline dolls. And sometimes we adult collectors get caught up in our feelings and how we want it. And we forget what these dolls are designed for. So here she is with her fabulous self. And I'm telling you, I just love her. I just love that these face molds are some of my favorites. Now, let me give you a little bit more advice. When you get ready to remove her from the box, if you're not planning to unbraid her hair, be very careful removing the plastic ties that they got her pinned down in the box because you can pull some of the hair from the braid. And I don't plan to unbraid her hair. I do not. So I was being very careful. Love the braids. Look at the colors in it. It is just gorgeous. I love her design. I love the design. They did an awesome job designing these dolls. Awesome design. I love her French braid. I mean, look at that. I mean, just look at that diva. Just She's got a fly away there that I'm going to have to clip. She's just gorgeous. Love her. Love the face mold. Love the print. Love the light brown eyes. She has a little beauty mark there over her lip. I don't know if you guys can see it. Love the lip color. Love the big earrings. I love them. Love them, love them, love them. I think they suit her so well. And she has a lot of accessories on here. A lot of necklaces there. She's got three necklaces on. And I didn't take her elastic things off because I don't want to lose them. So I'm going to leave that on. So let's go ahead and remove her jacket. She didn't have any tape on her jacket. So we were safe in that sense. So let's take your jacket off, girl. Let the people check out your jacket and see what you're working with. Let's put you back on the stand for the time being. Here is her jacket. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right, so here is the front of the jacket. I love that flame. That's, a, that's flames on her jacket. And this is the inside. Again, everything is nicely finished and hemmed around the waist there on the inside there and has a pocket but not a functioning pocket on both sides this is how it looks on the back each sleeve has the long fringe hanging from it you got the flame print all the way around the jacket which is always nice and then she has the cuff her sleeves are folded with cuffs on both ends and i like the jacket i love it love it love it and then let's take a look at her outfit so she's wearing this tank with the word love on the front love that as well 
it velcros in the back both pieces the shorts do as well love the shorts again she has functioning pockets as well those are functioning pockets love the design they did an awesome awesome job to me on these dolls and then she also comes with accessories on the arm she has this gold bracelet there as you can see and she's also wearing a pink watch didn't get all the plastic off your arm girl but we'll get that there we go and then here we go with these boots i love them they're like the timberland style boot with the high heel on them and i love the details in the boots this is what they look like underneath the bottom just like a real boot and look at those lime green socks i am loving these socks i love them i love the socks i love it i love it and her articulation is the same as number four back there these dolls are absolutely gorgeous i am so excited to have them i can't wait to get the other three but these were my favorites when i first got a peek at them and i jumped on getting them it was crazy oh i forgot her sunglasses too guys she comes with a pair of um dark sunglasses so let's put her sunglasses on so you guys can see how she looks with those glasses on i don't want to ruin her braid me and my hands my hands and my joints are always achy lately all right there we go there she is with her sunglasses on so there you go you get to see the diva with the sunglasses on she's quite lovely i gotta find her watch i really really do all right so here they are again i love these dolls i think these dolls are great um 2488 i think it's a fair price because you get a lot of doll here you get a lot um again like i said the pets are not my favorite they are really really cute and you know they are what they are you know when i display them maybe i'll display them with their little pets i don't know but they are cute but again <laughs> you know i could do without them i'm gonna stop saying that but I love them. On a scale from 1 to 10, I give these dolls a 10. And again, the price point to me is pretty fair. $24.88. You get all the separates. If you're, if you're going to mix and match them, you're going to have a lot of fun with these five dolls. Because you can mix and match their fashions or put them on other dolls. You know, whatever you decide to do. So, here are the Barbie Extra. Number 4 and number 5. So, number... One, two, and three will be coming in the near future. I've got to slow my roll with these dolls. I ordered a LOL um, Surprise OMG doll. I'm not going to tell you who she is. She was on sale, and I decided to order her. And um, she wasn't one that I was planning to get because of the price. But when they put her on sale, and she was going for the same price as the regular um, LOL OMG dolls, I decided to order her. So when I get her, you know I will share her with you here on the channel. Guys, I hope you enjoyed their review. Have any questions, hit me in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to check me out on Instagram. I am Ruby Red's World of Dolls there. Continue being awesome, fantastic, and fabulous. And I will see you in my next video. Thank you.